Let us do battle. Damn, I am tired. Just finished with three really long live streams from Poke Collection for his sixth birthday. That was a heck of a lot of fun. And, uh, yeah, I still have a Yu-Gi-Oh! video to do for you. So, here we are with the deck that I last used in Duel 159. Now, I don't think I've actually changed it, but the thing is, I didn't actually need to make any changes for the Forbidden Limited list. That is good. We have Assault Mode activated. That is good. Can we play Stardust turn 1? We can discard this. But I can't special summon the turn I activated, so I can't play Stardust this turn. Yeah. Pahander works. Mahander works. They can go together, but they can exceed. They can't... Synchro. Turn a Prism. Dang it. I'll take... Horse now. Two light thunder, 1600 less attack. Let's see if I actually still know how to play this stack in the first place. I'll take two prisms. I can normal per hundred together with one. Thing is, I can't for summon. That one is nice. Considering just placing these two face down and not doing anything, but I feel that placing monsters, possibly sacrificing them in the process, will have them not play as optimal compared to what I have planned for next turn. I can't special summon, but that was an initial normal summon, so that works. Response time, opponent. Response time. MST doesn't negate. That is true. However, what people do need to remember is that it can disallow certain cards to not resolve properly. These are continuous spells, continuous traps, and field spells, because they need to stay face up on the field to properly resolve. Um, pendulum cards actually work the same, like things like Clifford Scout. If you pay the cost to then MST it, they, you, they won't get the search. The cost is still paid. Kids outside having a lot of fun. That's good. Alright, bear. Chances are they would have summoned that anyway to destroy something. It'll still inflict battle damage to get another search. Yeah. I'll have to take it. Effect. Chances are they gonna use it. Not even announcing it. It's an optional effect. Come on. Now that I have a response, it's not a big issue, but... Yeah. Would it be like for him to for a tournament, I would just ask them to announce them? Good. 
is optional, then it doesn't need to be announced because it's optional. Right, they set tanky, we know that's tanky. That's probably a trap. Maybe it's another MST. Who knows? Chances are it's not though, because they blind MST the first card, they would have probably MST the second. But, uh, duality, uh, uh, I would like a soul mode activate, but if I believe duality, I can't synchro. Tanky's the first one, second one, I don't know what, chances are it, it could be bottom strapple, it could be torrential, it could be mirror force, a lot of things that Stardust can stop. So I am going to play Stardust. Do I play all of my cards though? I could put Hunter, normal summon into Prism, uh, Synchro the two and then have one Prism left, but no. I want to play it a little safe and keep the Prism <laughs> behind. Shokan. Nevlio no monsanitayo tuningi. Synchro Shokan. Arawario. Stardust or Dragon? Damn it. This is not good because he's going to get a tanky, he's going to get another bear effect. Huh. Thing is, I would have actually had to play Prism before his Compulse, because I was still thinking about that. But I saw Compulse, I was like, eh, I'm not going to bother with building the chain officially. No. But I wanted to use Prism, which would have cost me 500 life points, and then he would have had the chance to Compulse. So I'm sorry, he didn't know what Prism did either. Bujin deck. Because they're Bujin Firefits, but often when there's a deck with three tankies, I put in one bear because it's helpful with it. I have it in Constellars, and right now I'm trying it in Yosenju as well. So far it's been working pretty nicely. But I haven't dueled with it too much yet. Forgot the effect. Can't do it now anymore. That's not end of battle phase. I don't want to be too strict because it is unrated, but in a sense, I do want to teach him like how the rules work, if would they not know, or how specifically to go about things to make sure no misunderstandings happen, would you be like in a more important role, so that they have a higher chance. I just realized I have a Stardust Dragon Avatar. It's appropriate for this duel. It's like I'm awake or something. Well, officially I am, but I don't feel like it. I could probably fall asleep within 10 seconds if I lie on my bed. <sighs> Waking up at 4.50 in the morning three days in a row isn't fun. <laughs> Especially if you're used to waking up at 10, 11. Second day, I didn't actually... That was <laughs> probably already that tired that I didn't actually hear my alarm clock while it was switched on. I slept through it, woke, woke up two hours later, missed part of the show. But they went on for like 10 hours each day, and no, it was 7, no, 7 hours, and then today it was 9, almost 9 I think, oh, eight, no, 8 and a half hours, or oh, 9 and a half, something like that, it was long, but they were very enjoyable. Glad I was there. Get to release my inner J Lo. I didn't get to not like singing or dancing, but there was Pocket Collection Idol Factor Good Voice Talent, and I was one of the judges. And I 
and the judges had to act out a certain character, and I got J Lo. So I was J Lo, and J Lo happened to have a Mario accent. Well, she did the Mario accent at the end. Oh. One of the Bujingis. Two of the Bujingis. Eh, targets. That one's not that bad. To get a face up card, they can turn this straight. It's an ignition, so it's not all that bad, but this thing is a targeting. Yeah, the thing, the moment Assault Mode Activate was destroyed with uh, MSD, this duel took a turn for the worse. I don't have any searches right now. Like, I do have a, three Assault Beasts which can search for us, Assault Mode Activate. Normally you don't use counters. I understand that you're doing it because you sent four bujins, but normally you don't use counters because this card does not use counters. Yeah. 100 attack for each one, making 29. Thank you, makes 30. Even if I get another power or Mahunder, I can't synchro into Stardust because put duality. I can't. <sighs> Stardust assault that. No. Yay! Dark Hole actually works because that doesn't target. Thank you. I can actually use Dark Hole. If a Bujin be sorted, you can do a Wibbit Sword Battle Card Effects. Oh, he can save himself, of course. Stupid Alka. Stupid, stupid, stupid. Let's see if he forgets, because right now I don't know. If he forgets about it, I still have a chance, and otherwise I'm doomed. Because I'm not going to summon Prism. Because I, I, I could have extra defense, but then next turn I won't be able to do much. So I'm going to keep it and, and then hope I get. Um, was it Pahunder or Mahunder next turn so I can synchro and Stardust and then Assault Mode activate after to get. Stardust or Dragon Thrush Buster. Yep, that does work. Oh, I just sit there. Remove. Summon anything and he wins, really. Let's see it. What do you have? Game over. Oh, yeah, he did add Yamato earlier. I didn't know he had it. I didn't know he had it. Should have known. I should have remembered. Normally I do, but nah. I'll write to this already. Waiting until he performs his attacks. 